Rubenstein has long said, if you love what you do, chances are you're going to be pretty good at it. And Rubenstein Seafood Sales has certainly had an incredible legacy over the last 100 years plus, dealing with companies from all over the world. It began in 1905 with Adolph, continued on to Sydney, then to Marvin, and now most recently to Barry and his two sons, Adam and Jason. It is a tradition that has continued on for year after year after year. But first and foremost, they love what they do, relationships are most important, honesty, integrity, and making sure that the family name continues to be the most important thing that they share with their customers. Our business started in 1905. This is now the year 2012. I'm proud to say that our sales staff is fourth and fifth generation, which we've been told many times before it beats the odds of a lot of family businesses that do not go past the third generation. My father was a very honest and very smart man, and he had always preached to me that your name is more important than anything in the world. And that's the way that we moved our business in that direction where people can trust our name and trust the suppliers that we direct toward them to put together frozen seafood sales, whether it's shrimp, fish, from either the Gulf of Mexico or from anywhere around the, the world. I'm the fourth generation of my family in the shrimp business and w our company's been automatically peeling shrimp since 1969. We have a 20,000 square foot processing facility. We have a 20,000 square foot freezing facility across town. We unload about eight boats here in Biloxi, bringing in somewhere in the neighborhood of a million and a half pounds a year, and we're probably trucking in 12 to 14 million pounds a year from Louisiana, Texas, and Alabama. We were fortunate enough to know Barry's father, Mr. Marvin. Their family's just full of history. They've been in the shrimp business just as long, if not longer, than my family has, and it's, it's that length of time in the shrimp business to know not only you know, do they understand the product, but they understand what it takes on both sides, uh, for both the production side and the sales side, to make everybody happy. 1905, Adolf Rubenstein started uh, Rubenstein Produce Company, and he was a, a peddler. Back then was basically a handshake. There wasn't any contracts or anything to that point. That business went on for a couple of decades until the 40s when my grandfather Sidney Rubenstein with a sixth grade education and as things uh, continued to develop we had a processing plant here in Dallas, Texas that started breading shrimp. We also were a pecan processing packing plant. The brand was named after my mother, Lady Rita Pecans. We also had two processing plants in the Yucatan Peninsula of Mexico on the island of Carmen and in Campeche. We had established distribution with a broker network around the United States that knew our brand Gulf Princess like it was a household name. Early 70s is when I came into the business, went right into production, was in charge at a very young age obviously, 250 women and 50 men where we were processing breaded shrimp and other seafood products for national distribution. Dad said the first time, I think, opportunities are endless. You know, the sky's the limit. And I didn't really know what he meant until I saw like the first year customers increased by 50% and then the second year even more and the third year even more. And then I've built my relationships and my friendships, keeping the integrity of this company and having the legacy of this company is an, is an incredible piece to improve relationships with old clients and new clients. They love that we're a fifth generation. We're going to bring it straight to the point. We're not going to fudge on anything. We're not going to undersell them or undercut them. We're going to always bring it and put it right on the table. So I've built relationships. I've built trust. And majority of it is I really like the people. I love working with Rubenstein because they understand the industry. They've been in the industry themselves and they're a family owned company, which we are as well. So they understand the family pride dynamic and wanting to set your business apart. 
and Rubenstein's business and industry can help relay that to the customer for Philly and, and that helps Philly and that's why I feel like we work so well together. A lot of these customers depend on us. We save them time, we try and save them money and we try and give them a quality product so the, the orders are consistent. There's no point in selling someone one time. Any of the business that we try and build, getting one order doesn't really help because you're trying to build for the long run, for the tenure. On any given week when I'm having a great week for sales, it's good for me on one hand, but it's also great for our company because you can never pay your dad back. Being here, I know alleviates a lot of stress and we have a lot of fun putting deals together. We've been associated with Rubenstein probably since the middle 80s. We are a established relationship, a brokerage relationship where they sell our product and they've, they've done a very good job. We, we're very pleased with them. When they make a sale, they follow up on it and make sure everything's taken care of. They've uh, helped us develop some new products, some retail products, and so it's been a great relationship. We probably process somewhere around 10 or 12 million pounds a year. If you tell the truth, you don't have to worry about figuring out how to come back and, and fix what's broken with an offering or whatever you say to a supplier or a customer. It's best to make the offer as legitimate as, as possible, whether it's in writing or whether, whether it's verbal. And we've been company for over 107 years now, and I've got the next generation that has continued this process, and they love selling too. We enjoy going to the Boston Seafood Show every March where the whole world is under one roof. This is an opportunity for us to see many of our suppliers and customers and also make new contacts. We go there to work. I would you know, recommend them as being hugely honest. They're, uh, they're very, very loyal to a supplier such as ourselves. They're honorable people and I feel they're people we can put our trust in. And we provide a minority of the shrimp consumed in this country today. Ours is a different product, it's a special product, and it's a, it's a product that needs to be presented as different and apart from the run-of-the-mill pine race product that the public so often encounters. And the Rubensteins are able to do that. They're able to verbally communicate this to the customer base and, and in a very effective way. I'm involved with the production end of this product and securing the product he's able to effectively market it to these customers who appreciate the quality of our product. Rubenstein has been here for years. We know the business. We've got people that trust us and that we trust and they're going to deliver product that you need on a consistent basis at a quality price and you won't have to worry about not coming through with what you need. We know exactly how to approach a customer, we know what to offer the customer, and we have the suppliers that will take care of the customer. The suppliers then in turn take care of us. So it's a family almost, it's a unity that this company is the glue to our suppliers and our customers. With the relationship that our company has had with some of these suppliers, that tenure is what has given us the opportunity to get into some of these multi-million counts. So now they're full-time brokers and I'm still a full-time processor so now we deal quite often with uh, Barry and uh, Jason and uh, Adam. Total pounds we probably produce a little over five million pounds. Mostly the peel shrimp and then we also do some heather shrimp. And Barry sells m a, a lot of uh, peel shrimp for me which is really good for me because that's what we concentrate on is the peel shrimp industry. Actually, the number one selling broker for me over the last two years. My father instilled a lot of things with me in, in being very honest and having very strong integrity in what we do in offering our products. As the things continue to change, we have changed with them. There are opportunities without a language barrier of Chinese, Vietnamese, or uh, from Ecuador that we have continued to develop in, even though we are very, very strong in supporting all of our friends and suppliers in the Gulf of Mexico. A lot of people do not have any conception of what it takes from start to finish, what it is on their investments, uh, what it is to run a, a shrimp boat, 
all the conditions of hurricane possibilities can do to wreck a season and of course we all have a goal and that is to sell absolutely as much product as we physically and mentally can in a given day. Rubenstein Seafood Sales is a company that has been around for a long, long time, dating back over a full century. It was founded back in 1905 right here in Dallas, Texas, and to this day, it is owned and operated by Barry and his two sons, Adam and Jason. And they continue to be the conduit to so many incredible companies all around the world. They are a brokerage company of sorts for all these shrimp and seafood companies. But as long as that legacy has continued to be, they don't plan to stop anytime soon.